Hi, my name is Brian Wood. I'm a web developer and I create a lot of different kinds of learning content for people. And I actually have Travis Nielsen here with us from hey. Google. Yeah, uh, I design search at Google and I try to teach people what I'm learning by making videos like this and podcasts and speaking. Cool. So as somebody is learning UX design, I mean, what are, what are some of the best ways to learn it? I mean, UX is literally like anything. The way you learn it is just by doing it. So do it, do it. The way you're gonna learn it is by doing it. So do it. Yeah. Um, and then there, you know, there's other like general like learning approaches. Like be curious. Like when I say curious, I don't mean like try to find an answer. Just be curious about the topic. And this is gonna lead you to places that are unexpected. That's why being curious is more uh, efficient and effective than being answer driven. Right. Mm -hmm. um, there's also just like trying to be imaginative or be observant of, of yourself and the world around you. How do you interact with things? How do the people? What's trending? You know, like just be paying paying attention to stuff. See, to me, that's awesome because right? like I just every time I come across something where I'm like, this is bad user design. I mean, it's just pay triggers, attention to that. Right? Pay yeah, observe to that, kind of that stuff. stuff yeah, yeah. Right. And 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 those failures teach you so much. So mm -hmm. so observe failure and accept failure of your own. And, and how does it make you feel? Observe your own emotions, use your emotions and put that stuff into your, your user experience design. And then, and then we, you know, we collaborate. User experience designers are collaborators. We're, 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 we're team players. So learn how to understand and communicate and work with other people. These are, this is where you're going to grow. This is what you're going to uh, excel at by doing. Hmm. And then as you start doing, you start learning things that maybe you shouldn't have done. So you actually come <laughs> into some, maybe some, like, so what are some mistakes that you've made yeah. while learning? Um, while coming <laughs> All of them? <laughs> I think the mistakes that, that I've made personally have come from like thinking that I know, thinking that I have an answer and then always being proven wrong in the, in the discovery phase. I was gonna, so when you're doing research, you get it in front of somebody, yeah. that's a prototype and they, they do something completely different. Is that kind of what you're? It, it's, it's not a mistake to get proven wrong, yeah. but it's a mistake to think that you're right, mm. right? Because you're gonna get proven wrong. <laughs> Um, and then an, another mistake that I would make a lot early on is, is to think that I need approval. Like, like to say, is this a good idea? Should I try this? Don't, don't ask for that approval. Just go, go learn, go do some UX. You're the UX designer, go do it. You don't need approval to go be a UX designer. <laughs> go be it. Um, yeah, and then, and then sometimes uh, with any creative field or, or field that requires a lot out of us like UX does, sometimes we think that we're like not good enough or, or we, we're learning and it's too overwhelming and we think I could never be there. But thinking that you're not good enough, thinking that you're just faking it or you're an imposter, that is a mistake. Yeah, yeah. right. I think a lot of us feel that way sometimes. I but certainly have, yeah. And, and, and I mean, that's the mistake I continually make. But overcoming that is just to remember that I am good enough. I am a UX designer, whatever that is, I'm that. Yeah, and it's, you know, knowing that you also are, you're, suppose you are a web designer, app designer, et cetera, you are bringing skill set to this, right? Absolutely, so, yeah. yeah. Your unique perspective is what makes you a, a good UX designer, so bring it. Can, are, so this is a question I get a lot of. Are there different, what are some of the ways to get a job in UX? Getting a job in UX is, is I mean, same for kind of any field, right? Yep. Go where the action is. If you're like in this, corner of the internet and there's no UX work to be found, go to the corner of the internet where there is UX it's work to be nice, found. Yeah. Or move physically to a new city or, or, or go meet new people, go to a meetup, go where that action is. Yeah. Right? That's where you're going to do the next thing, which is find a gatekeeper. Gatekeepers are in every industry. These are the people who know other people. These are the people who know what projects are available or, or how to connect you to the thing. They, mm. they stand at the gate and they direct the way. Find that person. Maybe it's a mentor. Maybe it's not. Maybe it's just say. a connected person. Yeah. Right? Yeah finding a gatekeeper and providing value for them, providing value to the people who, who can connect you, who can uh, understand what you're, what you're going for. It, it, it's, hmm. it, you know? Yeah, it's, <laughs> sounds like secret sauce. Yeah, and, and the last thing that I would recommend for somebody trying to enter into this industry is finding out, you know, you mentioned like if you're a UX designer or, or a web designer, you come, you have these unique skills. What are those skills? Have they added to your unique voice? Find that voice. That's hmm. that's going to make you valuable. Interesting. Yeah, that's great. So it, it 
really doesn't end here, right? We've got to keep learning. Yeah, and absolutely. There are a lot of tutorials out there on Adobe XD you can check out, as well as on Adobe Creative Cloud on YouTube. So much good stuff, yeah. A lot of great stuff. And also, you have a website? Yeah, travisnielsen.com is where you can learn what I've been doing lately to teach people what I learn. And it's all about learning, so join us. I think all these links are down uh, below. Click away, get into it. Yeah, and I just, thanks so much for joining me. Oh, Travis. yeah, it's this been my is, pleasure. This has been awesome. So <laughs> you're just truly great information, so thank you.